Hey Helldivers, welcome to the new video. Today I'll be showing you how to use lossless scaling with Helldivers 2 to increase the performance. Now before we begin, we have to change some settings in game. So go to options, then display. Then the display mode should be set to borderless window or windowed. The lossless scaling app will not work on full screen. After that, you can open the lossless scaling app. Here you can make a profile for your game or use the default one. It doesn't change much. Scaling mode should be auto and full screen, scaling type to off. In frame gen, you have you can set LSFG 2.1. The mode I am setting is X3. I will tell you why in a bit. And copy these settings. After that you can head to settings and set up a scale hotkey, I am using Alt M or you can use the button, I prefer the hotkey. Before we scale, you check your in-game FPS with the graphic settings you want to use. I am getting around 60 FPS, my monitor is 144Hz. So the mode here, X2 is what you should be using if you are hitting constant 72 fps which is half of your monitor's refresh rate but i am not hitting 72 so i am using x3 which will be one third of my monitor's refresh rate which is 48 so you can cap you have to cap your game frame rate to 48 in my case it's 48 in your case it could be 72 or more considering your monitor's refresh rate you can cap your game frame rate through in game settings or use nvidia control panel or rtss after you are done we can start scaling the game I am hitting the scale button once, in 5 seconds the scaling will start, just click on your game before that. Now at the top left you would be seeing the FPS. The in-game uh, FPS currently are 38 but the frame gen FPS are around 115-114. So the game for me is actually very smooth there is a bit of latency but the game is smooth the obs i mean the recording software won't catch that the, it will be still stuttering for you but the game is smooth so most of it is done here you just have to check your fps cap your game and then start scaling some important tips uh, in case it doesn't work for you Disable all the overlays, the Steam, Nvidia, AMD, whatever overlays the game has, you should disable it because sometimes it causes issues with frame interpolation. And the uh, other problem is I've told you already FPS consistency, you, you should be hitting the capped frame rate all the time. So I'm turning the scaling off and here I'm hitting the 48 FPS at all the time. So it won't cause any issues with frame gen or frame pacing. The third tip is controller advantage. If you are using a controller, you will notice less of the latency penalty from frame generation because controllers are less responsive than mouse. Hope this tutorial helped you experiencing the power of frame generation with lossless scaling. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell icon for more head divers two tips and tricks see you on the battlefield thanks for watching peace